In my desktop, I have a file called mypassword.txt. If I open the file, I can see that this file contains the hash of a password. I have used hashcat to crack this password and I can see that the password was sunshine. Now the hash that was used is a md5 hash, that's why I use 0 here. But the question is, how did I know that this was a md5 hash and why did I use 0 here? So in this video, we are going to be learning how to identify hash algorithm and we are also going to be learning how to use hashcat. So let's get started. Now before we start tracking password with hashcat, a huge disclaimer. This video is strictly for educational purpose. I am just demonstrating how to identify the hash algorithm. Do not attempt to crack any password that you do not have the explicit permission to crack. All the passwords that I will be cracking in this video are generated by me. With that being said, let's continue the video. I will first right click and click on open terminal here to open a terminal in my desktop. If I give ls, I can see that I have a file called passwords.txt. If I cat the content of the file, I can see I have 5 passwords and their hashes. But for the purpose of the video, I will act like I do not know these passwords and try to crack these hashes with hashcat only. But in order to crack these hashes, I must know the hash algorithm that is used. So first let's find the hash algorithm that is used to make these hashes. So for that we need to install a tool called name that hash. So type the command sudo apt install name dash that dash hash and press enter. Type the password for your user and the tool will be installed. After the tool is installed, we can use the tool to identify the hashes. So I will type the command nth name that hash for short space dash t space in double quotation. I will copy and paste the hash. So I will copy any one of the random hashes. So I will copy the hash of the butterfly and paste it inside the double quotation. And if I press enter, I can see the tool ran successfully and it gave us some possible guess of what the hash could have been. We will only be focusing on the most likely one, least likely is not necessary. In the most likely, we can see the first guess that it had done was md5. So the chance of my hash being a md5 hash is the highest. Another thing that we can note is the hashcat id, it is set 0. So with this information, we can use hashcat to attempt to crack the password. So I will clear my terminal and type the command sudo space hashcat space dash m m stands for mode and then after mode we have to give the hashcat id we know that the hashcat id was zero so i will type zero here space in double quotation i will copy the hash and paste it space specify a word list so i will use the rockyou.txt so forward slash user forward slash share forward slash word list and then rockyou.txt. If you do not know what rockyou.txt is, it contains the most commonly used password worldwide, collected over a data breach, and is by default already available on Kali Linux. I will make a separate video on rockyou.txt, but just for now understand that it contains the most commonly used password. So after giving the hashcat command, I will press enter. And as you can see, my hashcat ran and it says it has cracked the password. And here you can see the password was indeed butterfly. And if you want to run the same hashcat command for the second time with the same hash, then give the command space dash dash show and press enter. Then you will get the output in this format, which is very simple. Now let's try a different password again. Now this time I will try to crack the hash of princess. So I'll copy the hash here and type the command nth space dash t space in double quotation, paste the hash and press enter. And after name that hash has ran, I can see in most likely the first one is SHA512 and the hash id is 1700. So let's try to crack this hash with hashcat. So I will type the command sudo hashcat space dash m space 1700 space in double quotation paste the hash space. I will give the same rockyou.txt file and it is under user share word list and rockyou.txt and press enter. And after hashcat has run, I can see the status is cracked and I get the password princess. So this is how you identify hashes and use hashcat. In a future video, I will make a very detailed tutorial on hashcat. This video is just for identifying hashes only. So if you like this video and want to watch more content related to Kali Linux or ethical hacking, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.